The ultimate red flags to look for in a guy's bedroom when you go home with him to know that he's trash, let's do it. First and foremost, look for any literal flag or tapestry hung on the wall, whether it be an American flag like this one or a fraternity flag, book it for dear life. They are trash and Saturdays are not for the boys. Listen, I'm not saying they need to be interior designers, but if the most creativity they can come up with is hanging up a piece of fabric on the wall, how creative do we think they're gonna be in bed? If their bed is in the corner of the room instead of the middle of the room. Dead giveaway, he does not have his life together. Next caller. And also if his sheets are navy. I used to hook up with this guy who had navy sheets and let me tell you, he is the spawn of Satan. And for all the guys that are gonna say, you just had a bad experience with one guy with navy sheets. Incorrect, I know way too many women who have had horrible experiences with guys in navy sheets. Just take my advice. Lastly, when he has one pillow on the bed. You think he can make room for you in his life when he can't even make room for a second pillow? What kind of psychopath only sleeps with one pillow? Run for dear life. My body different. Dude, I'm looking at this right now. I have an ugly smile. All right, try it again. Ow. Well, boys. Max, what are we doing? Can We're you tell? going to get a legal fish. Couldn't have said it better myself. We do too many illegal things on this channel, and that's how I get sued. All right, what, what's something funny, Max? The fact you don't have a girlfriend. <laughs> wow, bro. What? Because you don't, you don't kiss right. <laughs> <laughs> Why'd you say it like that? The fact that I'm sad now. It's gotta be good. His face is ugly. <laughs> <laughs> Mother Let's go. Jim, I have something really funny. What? You don't ha you don't own a Tesla because you're poor. Hey boss, can we get a tilapia live? We need we need one live. See, last time they killed it. They didn't give it to us alive, so we needed them to give us another one. We'll just not put him in water, I guess. Does that mean he's good? No. No, <laughs> no. Well, he's gonna well, die. Well. I just don't know if they are. There he is, on the tray. He's just laying there. He just left him on the tray. Oh, God. Yes. Yes, yes. Okay, all right, I got his face. I got his face. Okay. Oh, it's leaking. Okay, I got it. I slightly got it. Um, okay. Uh, oh, God. Oh, shiver me freaking timbers. Oh, oh. oh, well, we got the fish. We're gonna need to stop by a pond. I'm trying to wring the water out of this bag. Oh my god. Okay, boy. Shiver me timbers. He's in full water. Nice. Shiver, shiver me timbers. Timbers me shivy. What? We Here. should put that on the shirt. We should put that on the shirt. Oh man. You see that, guys? It's sick. These videos are nice, gnarly. Oh, you can see the shadow. All right, back home. Yep. Ba back home. Yeah. Yep. Okay. Home. All right. Cool. All right, here we go, like usual. There she is. All right, sir. Wow, this one's a different color. Kind of sick, I'm not gonna lie. All right, I'm, I know, you're in water and you're not doing too hot. Oh, God. All right, homeboy. I can't really do the whole acclimating thing because you don't have enough water to acclimate, so like, there you go. Home sweet home. Well, just so you guys know. <gasps> oh, it's nice and cloudy, sick. All that footage was filmed the other day before I got yeeted. Like, I, I got yeeted, all right. If you guys don't know, I was in a pretty bad car accident. My truck, it's tie rod snapped by the wheel. And I, I, obviously, I you can't really control it after that. And I did, poof, over a small cliff. Sick. But I think I think we've talked about this. We talked about this last week. 2020 has been the worst year ever. I'm not even being, like, sarcastic when I say that. Like, and it's not just for me. It's, like, for everybody. So I've, I've dipped been a little bit mentally depressed for the past month. But hey, we're still making videos. I have not checked on the fish, though. It has been a few days because I got in my car accident and the next day after we rescued the fish. So let's see how he's doing. Oh, sick. That just makes it so easy, considering the ducks made the pond so clear. Wow. That's so cool. That's sick. Nice. So I, I can't see him. <laughs> That's that's dope. Although there is a wild Steven over there sipping on some water. Steven! Steven! Yes, I'm talking to you. All the animals appear to be thriving. I'm pretty sure. Pickle boots. Hey guys, hi. C Craig! Why are you standing up? Where are you going? Alright, bye. <gasps> Waddles! Why'd you get scared? <laughs> hey, Waddles. Hi, Chad. Why is every why is everybody being so down? Like everyone seems so sad. Why is it? Cause I'm sad. You guys are supposed to be happy. The backyard overall, though, is the it's, it's the same backyard as always. So there's nothing really special about it. <laughs> right now, we still gotta do more stuff. Let me just turn this on really quick. Uh, okay. You know what you look like? You look like an Alaskan bullworm. It's exactly what you look like. I'm over here visiting Larry the electrician. You see you see him over there? Look at him, all curled up. Acts so innocent, totally shocks you. Hey, look how chubby these things are. Oh my god. You never really notice till you actually dead stare at them. That is the fattest fish. There's Larry. Hi there. Oh, we also call him Double A.
It doesn't work. What the heck? I thought I was about to do some cool science stuff and it didn't work. I thought it was going to shock me through the spoon. Is he just not shocking? Yeah, okay, he's shocking still. Just can't feel through the spoon. Wow. Well, the, the doctor gave me specific instruction not to do any physical activity, but this is really fun. But... Good work. Thank you, Mark. Well, hopefully you guys went on to enjoy today's video. Click the subscribe button down below. Woo. And if you guys have any great videos, ideas, or suggestions, let us know too. Go follow me on Instagram at fanatic.media. We have something insane planned for you guys tomorrow and all that good stuff. But I love you. Catch you guys later. Peace.